I'm tired, bitch. Eat like aristocrat shit. Yeah, let me tell you what my life like. A few months away from home to get my life right. Yeah. Let me tell you what my life like. A whole blood to the face on the late night. I'm tired, bitch. Pack them with you, have a safe flight. Yeah. Stack them up and make a play fight. Yeah. A hundred billion, that's the new goal. Yeah. John Ward at my new ball. Eat black yeah. aristocrat shit. Yeah. I'm a known ganger. Yeah. Playing game called a trap of hanger. They car it. Like we flipping every track of banger. Yeah. We getting money, don't say how to stream it. Yeah, don't call me. Nope. Don't call me. Nope. Don't call me. Nope. Don't call me. Why? Don't call me. Why? Don't call me. Why? Don't call me. I'm tired, bitch. Don't call me. Nope. Don't call me. Nope. Don't call me. Nope. Don't call me. Why? Don't call me. Why? Don't call me. I got a way to get this money back to mama. What up, my people? We with all the foolishness. We with all the foolishness. Welcome back. 2022. Season four. Year of the identity. We starting with all the foolishness. We starting with all it. All right. Welcome back, y'all. You feel me? Now, we got some of us that's listening to it on the app right now. So y'all just getting the audio. So it's all good. We ain't judging. Thank you. Hit that subscribe button. Tell a friend. Tell a friend. We available on all platforms, y'all. Wherever you listen to your audio or your podcast stuff at, um, Spotify, uh, Apple, iTunes, uh, whatever you listening to podcasts or I think reading books and all that. The audio platforms, we on all of them. All you got to do is type in the Black Aristocrats, all in one word, and we gonna pop up, man. Season one through four. Check us out. You know what I'm saying? Um, and if you watching us. We on YouTube, the Black Aristocrats. So, like I said, we with all the foolishness. So do not come over here because we with all the foolishness. So let's get it out of the way. Do not ask me why I got on this big ass jacket and I'm inside. I paused because we with all the foolishness. We got some new merch dropping, man. Y'all stop playing with us, man. I'm just stocking the inventory up. You know what I'm saying? You like it, you don't like it. Hey, help me out. You know what I'm saying? Let me know, man. It's that black aristocrat stuff, man. You feel me? Just a little merchandise, man. Um, so that's why I got this hot ass jacket on. So do not ask no questions. Let's get the fooling this out of the way. Cause y'all like, what? Why he sitting there with this big ass jacket on? Yes, I'm inside. It's comfortable inside. But I gotta show y'all a little bit of the merch. You know what I'm saying? So, hit me up. Uh, hit any one of the social media platforms up, man. And share your input on, like, as far as the merchandise go. And then we can work something out, man. I'm looking for ideas. I'm also looking for ambassadors. Um, you know? And I'm looking for some people who gonna do it on the love. Like my nephew Corey say, on the love. <laughs> you feel me? Y'all gonna know why I say that and use that joke. Feel me later on, but uh, yeah, I'm trying to get somebody to get me do me something on the love. You feel me? Yeah, but it's 2022. We here. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Season four. We back here for another one. Um, I don't have any New Year's resolutions. I'm too old for that. And uh, half the time I forget about the motherfuckers. Goddamn, the week after anyway. So. I don't make New Year's resolution goals, so I don't have any. If you got some, that's cool. That's fine. Um, Only thing I like to stick to is my vision board. So I'm going to always preach the vision board. You know, shots out JB. You know what I'm saying? They they, kind of introduced me to the vision board idea. So shots out them. I am am big on the vision boards. And why I say that? Because this is a little bold informative gumbo. Why I say that? Because... If I'm sitting in the house on my stagnant days, I done went days where I'm just stagnant. I ain't got, I call it the don't wants. I got the don't wants in me, dog. Like, I'm just, I just want to sit on my ass and not do nothing, unproductive and all that dumb shit. You know what I'm saying? If I'm sitting in the office, I got four vision boards up in the office. If I'm sitting in this mud, no matter where I pan to, you know what I'm saying? If I, if I just spin around on some lazy shit, or I'm, I'm drunk on some dumb shit. Oh! I just spin around, you feel me? Like, I'm going to see a vision board. 
And it had been times where it didn't hit me like, oh, I see the vision board and some might catch my eye like, oh, you might show the dude because I got to do like doing the push up, you know what I'm saying, for like the little fitness or whatever. So I see that man, <laughs> I see that nigga doing the push up, man. Oh, shit. Look around. Man, let me grab this little dumbbell right quick, man, and get me a couple little sets in. You know what I'm saying? Hey, it's a start. You feel me? It's a start. You know what I'm saying? So that, you know, um, it kind of gets me productive. Like, it starts the engine a little bit, man. So that's really why I'm big on, on uh, vision boards, because it actually provokes some type of action. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I might look again and see. I got a picture of, uh, like, some little podcast people, like Big Boy, Charlemagne, and stuff. You know what I'm saying? I got to look. Dust the boards off. Let me dust the boards off, man, and get back in here, try to whip something up. Even if I just turn the computer on or turn the boards on and, and play with the sounds a little bit, it got me. It started my engine. You know what I'm saying? It got me productive. So that's why I'm big on visions board, vision boards. So I'm definitely, um, that's that's like my, my little thing I like to play with. Um, so... Being that I don't have no New Year's resolutions, uh, I usually have a recap of the year episode, but it's sitting somewhere in the vault. Um, really, really, ain't really nothing, you know, that wasn't the, the ordinary, which is this COVID shit. COVID, 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 COVID. I'm about to start recording with a mask on, you feel me? Like, COVID, COVID, COVID. I'm tired of this shit, y'all. Like, y'all should be tired of this shit too, goddammit. You know what I'm saying? Every time you turn around, it's a it's a IU, Ryu, Bayou, a fluenza mixed with it. They breeding the motherfuckers like like puppies. <laughs> That's what they doing, though. Then that motherfucking lab breeding these goddamn strands like they mutts. You feel me? And they can't get a pure a purebred COVID. You feel me? So they got mutts coming along. Now you got the IU and the Bayou and the fucking you got influenza with this shit now. Goddamn! Look at the little motherfucking. <laughs> <laughs> running around this shit like god damn if not that them bitches like hurricanes they back to back with it shit i'm i'm sick of it though you know um you know i i, I say that to laugh and joke about it even though it is a serious matter uh the debate was hey you gonna get poked or you're not gonna get poked i don't want to say that word because i don't you know they're starting to ban a lot of the certain words and how you say it and shit but i call it the facts you feel me? You vax or you not? You waxed or you not? You heard me? That's gonna be the code name. You feel me? But uh, <laughs> so that was the big debate, dog. So like, not only do you have this COVID shit, um, 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 dividing people. You know what I'm saying? Now you you take all the medicines and all that shit into play, on top of the bullshit politics and all that, man. Like it's it's a fucking mess. It's a fucking mess. And then you got people like, oh shit, everybody going. Man, you about to be able to catch an Uber out of space real soon, y'all. I don't know how much, but you're going to be able to catch an Uber out of space. Ain't that some crazy shit? But when I see things like China and all that, they launching the sun and all that shit. That make me understand why motherfuckers going <laughs> out of space now, shit. I might have to catch me an Uber. You know what I'm saying? These motherfuckers launching the uh, artificial sun burns hotter than the sun so y'all launching some shit like that who is around when y'all launching this motherfucker if this bitch burn hotter than the sun y'all answer that hold on i'm tired bitch answer that question for me if y'all say that shit burn seven times however many times hotter than the regular sun you ever been outside landscaping nigga <laughs> in florida nigga in the middle of the fucking summer nigga that sun uh, on a good day where they might like, <laughs> where they hit you with the, oh, it's 89, but it feels like 110. Wait, what the fuck? Hold on now. This is a big difference now. I'm looking at my app like, hold on. Who lying? Somebody lying, bro. <laughs> Somebody lying. And then when you watch the, the fucking, the, the forecast on TV, nigga tell you, <laughs> he'll look dead in that camera and tell you, boy, where your raincoat is going to goddamn rain. And boy, you got your sunshades on the whole goddamn day out this motherfucker, man. So <laughs> you got shit like that going on, man. And it's like, whoo, I don't know what we going to do. You feel me? Like this shit is crazy, y'all. This shit is crazy. But you did, you didn't, you know, long as you stay safe. That's that, that's that part of it. Long as you stay safe, man. You're not jacking your ass every goddamn well. 
and then want to go hang out with the people you love with underlying conditions. Huh? You just took your ass to rolling loud in a COVID, a COVID cloud of smoke at that motherfucker. And you want to come around me and you know I'm goddamn, I'm a type, whatever, diabetic. You feel me? I got asthma and all that shit. You want to come sit your ass at my house and tell your stories how much fun you had with your little healthy ass. You gonna bring your little, your little COVID healthy ass around me and you know I got these underlying conditions? You trying to kill me, motherfucker. Huh? <laughs> Some bullshit, man. You trying to kill me, man. You feel me? So just stay safe, man. Just stay safe. But um, back to, I, I went off on the tangent, my bad, but back to, now you see why these motherfuckers is going out of space, man. Either China showing off their new weapon or <laughs> They telling motherfuckers, look, bro, <laughs> technology that, nigga. Huh? Y'all, y'all say y'all the best. Let me see y'all motherfuckers launch a sun. Next day, the U.S. going to try to launch a moon. Watch. It's going to be nighttime. The United States has officially launched their moon. Huh? I would rather the motherfucking moon hovering over me any day of the week than the motherfucking sun, big. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> I'm tired, God damn, dog. So. You got all that going on, man. You know what I'm saying? So you got the, the China launching the sun. This is how we're gonna start the new year with this with this foolishness. We starting the new year off with uh with the little puppy strands, the little mixed breeds of COVID strands running around this bitch. You heard me? And we got China launching fucking suns, all they new weapons, whatever y'all want to call it. Y'all call it the sun because they say, you know, oh yeah, it's for good renewable, non-renewable resources and that type of stuff, you know, and it, it'll help with that and Whatever artificial power and blah blah blah. No man, I think that's their new weapon. That's their new weapon, and they're trying to show the United States. They're trying to tell us y'all top that motherfucker, top that. <laughs> you feel me? And Squid Games was number one, motherfucker. For all these weeks out there, y'all, <laughs> and they've been showing they motherfucking uh, a movie out there went number one. You feel me? They made a big deal out of this, y'all. I'm sorry, I had to say that, bro. They made a big deal about this, like oh. China's number one movie film has grossed more than whatever, whatever, and it's about them defeating the United States in an epic war. What? <laughs> so we supposed to feel some type of way about that shit, man? We always win in all our movies. What you mean? You feel me? So it's only right they do that. Shit, you think I'm going to write a movie and I die in the beginning, motherfucker? <laughs> you, out, you out your goddamn mind, man. But, um... Yeah, so we, that's how we starting the year off with that type of foolishness, y'all. Y'all just stay away from that foolishness. I'm going to take off this uh, hot-ass jacket, y'all. And, you know, happy new year. Y'all look forward to us taking off. Y'all look forward to the episodes being like this, you know, with more pizzazz, you know, a little more swag, you know, because before, uh, a lot of my episodes, man, was like just monotone. I'm just talking the same way, and it's just, nah, bro, I ain't had no swag and none of that with me. So that's why this is the year of the identity. Black aristocrats, you feel me? Y'all stay safe out there. Y'all enjoy. Please enjoy. This is the adult holiday season right here. You know, the first quarter of the year, you feel me? We getting them taxes. If you ain't getting them taxes, you're kicking out taxes. And that's not a bad thing. So if you're kicking out taxes, guess what? You made some money. Hey, hey high five. Woo, good shit. Now let's make more. Uh, thank y'all for the support. The Black Aristocrat Podcast. We are the Black Aristocrat shit. This is the Black Aristocrats Podcast. Rattle. Uh, uh, uh.